Hello Sparkle Squad and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jessica Sparkles and it is December 1st. Merry Christmas. Yay, yay, yay. Um, so that means this will be the November coloring pages that I have finished video. So I've got a stack of books over here. So let's go ahead and start and go through them in no particular order. This is from Intricate Flowers by Jade Summer. Finished this one the other day, and I used Sharpies and a Sakura uh, Jelly Roll for the glittery orange flowers there. You can see them sparkle up. So there is that one. I like how that one turned out. And that was Intricate Flowers by Jade Summer. Hopefully I have room to stack all of these. Next, I've got one out of Kawaii Grayscale Coloring Book, Jade Summer. This is the one I did a video on. And I did this one right here. Love how she turned out. So pretty. So I used the uh, Kelly Art markers, I believe. And Sharpie and a white gel pen and some glitter gel pen in there so like I said there is a video on my channel for this one love her love how she turned out this book sadly is no longer in production so I am very very sorry about that I didn't know that at the time when I did the video but you can watch it anyway if you'd like if you haven't seen it yet but that's kawaii grayscale coloring book by Jade Summer Then I've got one out of Cute Fairies Grayscale by Jade Summer. I went on a Jade Summer tangent here at the end of the month. <laughs> um, this again was done with uh, Cali Art markers and I think I used a Copic on this. I think the purple was Copic. And this beautiful pearl detail that you see is the Nouveau Crystal Drops. I believe that was like um, something pearl no not pearl maybe was something but I really really loved the way that this come out I love it I love how this looks like pearls it when I saw this picture I was just like she's gonna have pearls everywhere because she's me and I am her and we are one in the same we love our pearls so that's what I did and I really really love how she turned out I think she is just gorgeous so that was out of fairy, Cute Fairies uh, Grayscale Coloring Book. I just woke up and my words don't want to, they just don't want to. <laughs> okay, so I did one out of Joanna Basford Ivy and the Inky Butterfly. I didn't do nothing crazy. I just did the little, um, this right here. <laughs> uh, I used my, what did I use on this? Oh, I believe these were the Spear Farben uh, colored pencils here, and this is just some glitter gel pen there. So this is my second copy of this book because my other one it started falling apart, and I didn't really wasn't happy with some of the pages I colored in it. So I went ahead, and this is my new, fresh, beautiful copy. So I will be coloring out of this. So there's just that one, Ivy and the Inky Butterfly by Johanna Basford. I started Christmas coloring early, so here we have Christmas Mandalas by Camellia Angel Kova, and I just done the This Book Belongs To page, because that's always a good place to start, and I want to thank Miss Nikki again for sending this to me, and the Coloring Diva also sent me a copy of this, so, um, Miss Coloring Diva, I gave that copy to my Aunt Rhonda, and she appreciates it, and, to, uh, Told me to tell you thank you. Did I give it to Aunt Rhonda or did I give it to my mom? I think it was my mom. Yeah, it was my mom. My mom has a second copy. I gave my Aunt Rhonda a different book. But uh, they, anyway, she, my mom says thank you too. So, I did this with just Sharpie and some glitter gel pen, as you can see on there. 
so like that and all I did was outline stuff so always love to do that because it's simple but yet very effective and it is very glittery so there's that one and I'll be working out of this for our color along which starts today which I will be filming as soon as I finish this video so that was Christmas mandalas by Camellia Angel Coba spent too much time on that one Next, I have one out of A Million Mermaids by Lulu Mayo, and this was a buddy color I did with Crafting with Christy, so that was really fun. I haven't done a buddy color in a very long time, so that was fun to do. So I've done this little, this little picture right here, and I did this with my Arteza watercolors watercolor pencils and some I think this was the A and Art gel pens that I just kind of went over and some other things so it's sparkly and then I just took black acrylic paint and painted the background and a white gel pen with my little my little circle maker here and put in some bubbles that I painted over and I think it turned out really really cute really like how that turned out so that was fun to do with Christy so again, that was A Million Mermaids by Lulu Mayo. Next, we have one from Tales from the Midnight Masquerade by Hannah Carlson. And I did this beautiful little mask right here. This was done with Archie's watercolors, some fine tech, um, what's it called? Fine tech, uh, metallic or pearlescent watercolors so that's the gold that's on the mask and then some gold stickle and this silvery bit here is also the gold that's on the mask and then we have stickles I'll hold it up so you can see see that gold flash isn't that pretty and then at the end I just took some of that metallic watercolor and flicked it on the background and grabbed some purple off of the pencils and flicked it on and it mixed with the gold and it just made a really pretty background. So I actually really like how that turned out. So that was Tales from the Midnight Masquerade by Hannah Carlson. You might hear my chair squeak, it's being squeaky. I have two. You know I couldn't do a uh, a month without doing out of Creative Haven's Rose Window, so I've done two out of this one for the month. And the first one is this one here. I think I used, I don't remember what I used. It was probably Sharpies or Cali Arts. So I like those fall colors. I think that one turned out very pretty. And I've done this one here, and I believe this one was probably Sharpies. Looks like Sharpies. So I like those colors too. Very mermaidy. Really like that. So those are the two out of Creative Haven Rose Windows. We have one, two, three, four more books. <laughs> So I done one out of Chibi Girls Coloring Book Volume 1 by April Amber. I love this book. I did this little cutie patootie right here and I used Kelly Art and I think I used my Copic markers for, yeah, the pastel colors is Copic. Some glitter gel pen and I think she turned out super cute. This paper is really nice in this book too. It's like really, really nice. So there's her. Oh, and I colored her too. I forgot. But yeah, I colored her too. <laughs> so there's that one out of Chibi Girls Coloring Book Volume 1 by April Amber. Next up, Kawaii Horror by Jade Summer. And I did this one right here. Again, this was done with Cali Arts and probably... Um, Sharpies and of course glitter gel pen and I love her I think she is very gorgeous I really like how she turned out love this beautiful dark red and then like the red this was I think this red here was actually my um, 
these here, the ZR glitter paint markers. I think that's what I did this red with. And I believe that might be, no, the gold I think was a gel pen, but she turned out very, very pretty. And I just love her. So I don't know if you can see that. I think you can see that sparkle on there. So there's this beauty. And again, that was Kawaii Horror Grayscale. I've done two out of 50 Winter Miniatures by Camellia Angel Cova. This is where my winter and Christmas started. So I did this beautiful little penguin page here. And this is just done with Sharpie and Cali Art and a uh, gold gel pen back there. And then all of this beautiful snow that you see, just, I don't even know if that's showing up proper, but like in the hats and down here in the snow. This was a glitter glue that I, <clears throat> that I found at uh, Walmart. It's like a chunky glitter glue in clear and I thought it would be perfect for snow and I love it. <clears throat> Excuse me, let me get a drink of my coffee. Goodness, got a tickle. Ah, oh, that's better. So I think this just turned out super sweet. And then I did this little owl here. Again, Kelly Art Sharpie gel pen, stickles, and that glitter glue. And I just love how this one turned out as well. They're simple, but yet they just turn out so cute. So I love Camellia's books so, so much. And I just love that snow and all the sparklies. So couldn't wait to start coloring Christmas, and I'll definitely be coloring out of this one too, maybe even today. This might be the book I use for today's color along. So love it. So that was 50 Winter Miniatures by Camellia Angel Cova. And last but certainly not least, I've done one out of Color Ya Mandalas. I believe they got a Mandalas 2 book out now. I've done this beautiful page here. This was all done with the a and Art glitter gel pens, and it reminded me of Peacock, so I did it in Peacock colors, and I hope you can see, let me turn it this way, the beautiful glitter. Let me stand up, maybe you can. There you go. Yeah, you see that? Isn't that gorgeous? It's so beautiful, so glittery. I just love it. And a very sweet friend of mine had sent this book to me. So uh, this is the first page I've colored out of it. And this one took me a little bit, but I think it turned out very pretty. So that, my sweet friends, is all of the pages that I colored for the month of November. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big fat thumbs up. I would appreciate it. And if you're new here, welcome. I hope you consider subscribing if you haven't already. And if you have, make sure that you have that bell rung so you get notifications when I upload new videos. I try to upload one to two every week. And we'll probably be doing more as um, for this month because of the color along. So I do have color along going. If you didn't know, it is hashtag Jessica's Sparkly Christmas 2020. <coughs> goodness excuse me and all we're going to be doing is coloring Christmas and winter pictures and sparkling it up so use your gel pens use your glitter markers your stickles your metallics your paints whatever you have that's sparkly and shiny use it you can use stick on gems anything you want just make it sparkly and make it fun so uh, I would like for you to hashtag that over there on Instagram so I can see all of your pictures. You can also post your pictures in my Facebook group and the link will be down in the description for that group. It is the Sparkle Squad, or Jessica's Spar Sparkle Squad is what it's called, but the link is like facebook.com slash group slash just whatever. It's down in there. It's down in the description. So be sure and go ask to join that group. You can post whatever you like in there. I am not picky anymore. Um, 
I just, you know, hope that just want you to keep it respectful. But you can do, like I posted a picture of my Christmas tree in the group yesterday. If you'd like to see it, I've got it up and it is glorious. So also have all the ways that you can follow me on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat. Um, I think that's all. Pretty sure that's all. <clears throat> but all of that information is down there in the description. So be sure to check that out. I also have a link for all of these books except that one Jade Summer which was discontinued, which is very sad. So with that, <laughs> I'm going to end this video and I'm going to get it uploaded so we can do start our color along next. So I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you in the next video. And remember, don't ever let anybody dull your sparkle. Goodbye, Sparkle Squad. Thank <laughs> you.